What's up guys, it's your boy Jarvis, AKA Big Bro 616, checking in with another video. We need footage, baby, I'm trying to keep the channel active. Um, couple things going on today. Um, I gotta get a, put, I gotta do an oil change on the truck, even ASAP. I hate, I know that I'll be waiting too late to the last minute, but I definitely need an oil change on the Yukon. Second, the driver door power went out on a Yukon. Uh, I don't know, it's, it gotta be an electrical problem because this happened before. And my uh, one of my good friends, one of my good mechanic friends, Adolfo, uh, he fixed the problem. So I guess, you know, what happened with these vehicles is, you know, during the cold weather, the, the wires get um, jammed up or they get, they get cold and they crack. And so I think a wire might have uh, broke inside the door or cracked or came apart or something happened. It's not the switch, it's the wiring because it happened before uh, a couple years ago. Uh, so we're gonna jump, uh, we're gonna shoot down the auto zone. We're going to the hood, baby. We're going to the, the hood auto zone on Hall Street. And we're gonna uh, get up under this truck, change this oil. Then we're gonna open up this door. And we're gonna try to figure out what the problem is. So stick around, man. If you're here just watching this video, make sure you like this video. If you like the content, subscribe to the channel, man. I mean, it ain't one of the hottest channels out here, but it's a good, definitely a good channel. I try to stay active as much as I can. And uh, share the video, man. You know what I'm saying? It'll help a brother out. Uh, with that being said, it's your boy Jarvis, AKA Big Bro 616. Stay tuned. We on our way to AutoZone, baby. Guys, we made it to AutoZone. Uh, I chose this auto zone location because you know it's usually uh, people out here working on their cars in the park a lot. And today it's a nice day. It's almost 40 degrees. Um, but there's nobody out here. I don't know if it's early. But I'm just gonna uh do it myself. I just wanted to get a second opinion about this uh this door panel. Uh like I say, I have no power over here at all. And it's not the switch. I'm guessing that it's a problem inside of there. Or oh, we're just gonna take the panel off the panel off and just uh go from there. Cause it might be in here. Cause this is the only thing that could have opened that made it made the wiring. Cause this is so active, opening and closing the door all the time. So we'll see. But first uh first things first, we're gonna jump on this oil change real quick. So stay tuned. Yeah, with the auto zone, all in division, the ratchet got you one. So we're gonna get up under here. Let's see what's going on with this oil change. Got my catch can. Let's get busy. Hey, ain't no napkins nowhere? No. Y'all see the oil pulling out of there? It's pretty dirty. But it ain't, it ain't that bad. It could be a lot worse. It's the oil leak. They really do. The key is to clean up as much as that oil access. You know, as much of this oil shit as you could. Thank you. 
Yep, guys. I got the oil filter off. Now I'm about to run in AutoZone and uh, get the correct oil filter because I always get the wrong one. Stay tuned. What up, bro? Me and AutoZone trying to find it. Yo, that's the only downfall. The down part. That's the only down part about coming to the one in the hood. The motherfucker workers don't act like they don't know what the fuck going on. Like you going to ask for car parts, they act like you speaking Chinese or something. But we got the filter. So this is what I need, I hope. So let's go up under here and throw it on, man. Let's successfully get that up there. Make sure we get that nice and snug. We're just gonna take our 15. Leave it like that. Clean up everything. Clean up your mess. Everything looks good. Nice and clean. How's that? Everything looks nice and clean. There's that. There's that. Let's fill it up, baby. Stay tuned. All right, guys. Time to put our oil back in the, in the truck. Sorry about that, guys. Man, my phone had died in the middle of me pouring up the oil. I don't even know how far that, that part got. Uh, got the oil change done. And I spilled oil all up my back because I was laying down trying to put the, uh, the oil filter on there. And I fucked around and I had opened up the small oil, the small quarter oil to, you know, how you put oil around the, the, the ring of the um, oil filter before you put it up there. And I forgot to put the cap back on it. And my stupid self messed around and <laughs> what an idiot. Man, I spilt it while I was it was while I was laying on my back. And it went all in my booty, all up my back. I feel so gross. I probably I, I kinda wanna go to the hot tub just to soak uh, out in Oasis. So we'll see, man. Hopefully that's something that I can do today. It's my off day. Uh, I wanted to jump on this door panel, but uh, I probably still could. But I want to go sit in the hot tub, man, and just chill. See if my baby mama up to it. If not, I'll go out there by myself. All right, man. With that being said, man, I'm gonna end this video, man. Thank you for tuning in, YouTube. I'm trying to get that footage for you guys. Uh, got the, got some major done today. We got the oil change done on the Yukon. Then my battery died, and I had to pull up the Joes and um, give me a charger. Um, yeah, man, it was lit. I loved it. Um, 
I'm gonna end this video. It's your boy Jarvis, aka Big Bro 616. I'm, I'm trying to bring that footage, guys. And everybody, thank you for the, all the concerns. Thank you for everything, all the love. Um, we working on it. We, we, we trying to find us a new old school. We don't just want to jump into the uh, the first thing we see. But we got a couple options. And I might bring you guys along to go check out a couple of them. I think that'd be dope. Let's go check out a couple old schools. Uh, I don't know if I want to buy a project or if I want to buy one that's already together. The project thing was kind of fun. It just sucked that I spent all that time and, and money trying to get it to where it was at for that to happen, for me to take a, a total loss. But it was a learning experience. And I know next time I deal with, with the insurance companies, I will make sure I have some type of comprehensive on there because that, that just, ugh. <laughs> that was just, man, that was a tough pill to swallow. But you know, things happen for a reason, man. Everything is in life is a lesson learned. With that being said, guys, thanks for watching. It's your boy Jarvis, a.k.a. Big Bro 616. I'm out of here, guys. Peace.